Sally Sore Loser, a story about winning and losing by Frank J. Cilio, illustrated by Carrie Pillow. The publishing company is Imagination Press. The copyright date is 2014. Sally loves to play games. Sally loves sports. Sally loves to be first in line. Sally likes to finish her macaroni and cheese before her brother. Sally loves to be the first out the door at recess. Sally loves to win and she hates to lose. One day during recess, Sally and her classmates were playing a game of soccer. During the game, Sally was hogging the ball, as usual. When her team was losing by three points, she screamed, Do you want to be a bunch of losers? Let's win! Emma said to Sally, Stop being so bossy! Who cares if we win or lose? It's just a game. Sally snapped at Emma. Well, I don't like to lose. Winning is the most important thing in the world. During the game, all the kids walked away from Sally. Sally screamed, Where's everybody going? We didn't finish playing. We don't want to play with you anymore, Sally. We're going to play somewhere else, Carlos said. You're not fun to play with, Diane told Sally. You are Sally's sore loser, Jeremy shouted at Sally. Sally began to cry and sat in the middle of the field. After recess, Sally's teacher, Mr. Taylor, spoke to her. I know everybody wants to win at games. It's okay to feel disappointed when we lose, but when we act like a sore loser, other kids don't want to play with us. When we play games or sports, all we need to do is try our best and have fun. Let's review the rules for being a good sport. One, be polite to your teammates and the opposite team. Two, cool down when you get upset. Three, don't show off or hog the ball. Four, don't argue with a teacher, teammate, opponent, or referee. Five, know the rules of the game. Six, be fair to everyone. Seven, never ever cheat. Hey, try your best and have fun. A sore loser or a bad loser can get angry, frustrated, or sad about losing. They may also be bossy and bully their teammates. They may cheat or argue with their friends and the grown-ups, Mr. Taylor said. Mr. Taylor explained, bad winners brag and tease others about losing. Sally thought about a time when she was playing a video game with her friend Ava and laughed at her for losing. After the game, she shouted out, I am the best video game player ever. Oh, thought Sally. Sore losers and bad winners win nothing, and they can lose their friends, Mr. Taylor told Sally. The next morning, Sally did not eat her breakfast. She kept pushing her cereal around her bowl. She kept hearing, Sally, sore loser, over and over in her mind. What's wrong, Sally? her mom said. The kids were mean to me yesterday. They didn't want to play with me at recess and they called me a name. 
What did they call you? They called me Sally Sore Loser. And then Mr. Taylor told me that bad losers and bad winners never win anything and they can lose friends. Mr. Taylor gave you excellent advice, Sally. Here's something for you to do and remember today at school. I want you to think of all the fun things about playing games like being outside and being with your friends and laughing with others. But if you are starting to lose at a game, I want you to take a deep breath, let it out slowly and say to yourself, I've won if I had fun. At recess that day, all the kids started to play a game of kickball. When Diane missed the ball three times, Sally wanted to scream. But instead, she took deep breaths to calm down and she called out, A uh, good try! When one of her teammates kicked the ball, it went out of bounds. The other kids were arguing about it. She said, hey, everyone, um, instead of arguing, how about we just have a do-over? Hmm, good idea. When it was Sally's turn to kick the ball, she got to first base but was tagged out. She started to get upset and cry, but then thought, wait, I've won if I've had fun. The recess bell rang. Sally's team had lost. Jeremy came up to Sally and said, good game. You weren't a sore loser today. Sally said, oh yeah, thanks. Um, it's still hard to lose, but I won because I had fun. The end. Hmm, what do you think about that? It is kind of hard, isn't it, when we're losing to keep a good attitude? Hmm, what do you think about Sally's change?